TM. If you're playing, and oh dear, this is okay. Now, what the hell is going on with the starting position? Completely confusing. And Blair is okay, playing what looks like a good move, trying to get his bishop here. I'm going to do the same over here. And we do get one second to move, which is something. Uh, bloody confusing positions. And one thing, one thing I keep forgetting about is the castling move. There is the castling move. You've got to try to remember that one, Simon. You can castle. So let's not drop that pawn. And to castle, you. That there you go. Blair's shown how to do it, and he's. <laughs> You see, it's so it's such a weird, it's so weird, this whole thing. Um, I might castle this way as well, but I might try to castle on the opposite side because it makes it quite interesting to start with. I'm just going to sneakily. Oh, okay, what do we do here? God, I'm so slow. I'm just going to move that one out of the way in case he comes forwards. Speed is of the essence. There you go. Look, that's castling absolutely mental and now i'm going to try to attack him but blair's attacking me and his attack looks quite scary castling this side was very risky very very risky and uh oof, i could see mary hatman started with a win well done mary uh so we're both going for an attack here who's going to get there first i don't know blair's attack i must admit looks quite scary I'm going to try and close the position down, but look at my queen. Look where my queen is. My queen is looking absolutely stupid. So I'm now trying to expand a little bit over here. And I've got the exchange, but maybe the exchange is not even that good in this position. I don't know. It might not be even that good because my rooks are very blocked in. So I look at my queen. I've got to get my queen out. So I'm going to try and maneuver it around somewhere like this but now he's getting rid of my knight i'm going to get rid of his knight what is going on here people okay we're going to break try to give my rook or bishop some space and let's try to now open up his king a little bit um come on harry do your job and i got actually a time advantage which is really peculiar for me i never have a time advantage and now if i get my queen in the game I have managed to open up some lines. So good move from Blair. But his light square bishop is really quite bad. But do I want to exchange queens? Do I? Do I? I don't know. No, I don't think so. So I'm going to try to get my queen and rook somehow into the position here. I'm sneaking around the side. But Blair so far defending well. Okay, now... I will go for this position, but I don't even know if the ending is the right thing to do. This might not be correct, this ending. Oh, God. Could I be, even be worse here? This is this is anyone's game. I'm trying to get my king in front of that pawn so it can't queen. This is a long game for one minute as well. Now, do remember, you can also take part in oh dear i'm trying to think and talk not good i'm hoping now ari will go come on ari come on up you go uh he's stopping harry god this is so complicated yeah and now i've got this little trick because if he takes it i can check here and take that one oh <sighs> Oh, that was hard work. Remember, if you want to enter, that's only the first round. It's official random. Uh, 960, one minute plus one second to move. And each position, you start with a random position. And you will get a chance probably to play me. And I've no idea what, you know, it's it's just, uh, let's just say this is one of the more complex streams i've done so it's actually quite hard i won't be looking at the chat as much because it's quite hard to keep an eye on the chat whilst trying to avoid losing and look at that look at my bishop all of a sudden very nasty for him thank you for the cheer and any subscriptions that i do miss 
obviously this is a very hectic tournament so um it's going to be hard to keep up with all the chat but i will do my best uh and we it's just a one hour tournament you can come and play so there are the details if you want to come and play we've now got 35 players so we've got a good number of players and uh there'll probably be a dvd prize to the person who does best why so serious i had to say that very long thank you for the raid that's very kind of you why so serious <laughs> i like that i like that name whoa what's happening here oh dear i've dropped a pawn thank you for the raid very generous of you if you just come in from the raid um i, I think that is s uh, yeah i think it's mark esman hello mark if you just come oh i could have taken that one i'm going mad i was defending that one if you just come from the raid you can come and join in you can come and join in this tournament with the details that i have given oh, i could have taken the night there i'm not i'm not playing very sharp talking looking at raids and trying to do loads of stuff <laughs> it's hard work yeah what's going on here his move is it it's my move i don't even know whose move it is um well i'm gonna say not just the dutch for life uh mark but also the uh uh, oh god i can't even remember it the gambit <laughs> i can't even remember the name of the gambit um okay keep i keep not seeing my opponent's moves um the gambit that mark Esman is very famous for it's a very dangerous gambit i hope everyone has got his book i've got his book even if i can't remember the name of it while i'm playing i'm so bad at multitasking whoa that move looks rather risky okay oh i can calm down now the mora gambit thank you guys the mora gambit that is the one and if you want to join in the chaos, which is just a fun one hour tournament, if you join those two links there, you can see, well, there's 52 minutes left of the tournament. Here are the rankings. There's 38 players. It's one plus one, and it is chaos. It's complete chaos. It's one plus one. This is a chaotic stream. It's a chaotic Saturday stream. Uh, again, thank you for the raid there, Mark. That's very generous. Um, I can't really play the Mora in 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 this position it's 960 one plus one if that makes any sense so every position is unique every position is different and i'm now going to try to checkmate him on g7 because it seems like something to do i don't know if it's a good idea but it seems like an idea and i feel oh he's, he's cheekily trying to take my pawn and i think in in 960 it's actually a really good way to try and try well okay let's just attack it's a good way to sort of work out how your pieces coordinate and um like not as in normal chess because it's really it is sort of normal chess but it's kind of not normal chess as well so he's done a good job monique of blocking my bishop here now i would like to put that let's put that in there that looks like quite a nice square because he can't attack that piece and i might now try to get my queen oh he, he can attack that piece i didn't see that one but I might, I'm going to sack it. Oh, that's probably, okay. Is that good or bad? I don't know. It looks, it looks like a way to play. Don't know if it's good or bad. And this is again, he has to go queen takes. And he's got this one on pre, right? He's kind of stopped all my threats so far. Um, oh, he didn't take that one. Oh, that was not a good move. And now I'm in. Now I'm in. Whoa. Now I'm in. I could have maybe i had some other way to play this but oh okay okay i see what you're trying to do to me i see what you're trying to do to me he's trying to do some nasty stuff but i think i'm going to pick up a lot of his pieces now after bishop d5 um hello to my opponent monique who, who is a uh, is a a long time follower of this channel so even though i'm completely winning here i've got to pay a little bit of attention he, but he can't really checkmate me just with a queen not unless i do something really stupid and i'm now quite a lot of pieces up here so well when i say quite a lot of pieces i'm like i mean how many pieces am i up here too too damn many i think is is the thing and as long as well i mean actually the challenge here would be to lose this position um <laughs> monique saying thank you for the game just Thank you for the game, Monique. Okay, so, yeah, like you say, there's still 50 minutes left of this insane tournament. I'm going for a clean run.
Can anyone can anyone get in, anyone can come and play? Get involved. It's open. You just have to follow those two links I've put in the chat there. It's Fisher Random, so every single starting position is different. You've got to think 100 miles per hour. It's one minute plus one second. I know this might be quite quick for a lot of people, including me. Mary Hatman. Look at Mary. Mary's now jumped into the lead. Mary said this time limit was too quick for him, and he's jumped into the lead. So, Mary, you are... It's obviously not that quick for you. Um, I see someone's asking about a chessable course on the French defence, but... I, I have to say, I don't think that's going to happen because there's two very good, very good uh, uh, French defence courses already. You've got Geary's course, which has just come out, and I think you've got Harry Krishna's course. So you've got two super grandmasters that have done courses on the French. So I don't think I, I will be doing one because there's just too many, too many French defence. I like this rook swinger, but... How do I get my bishop out? I'm not very happy. Okay, we need to do that to get my bishop on a1 out. I think the key with Fisher Random, if you're watching this and you're thinking, oh, this is what the hell's going on, you're not the only one. You're not the only one. I don't know what the hell's going on. Um, but the thing that Fisher Random that I've just tried to do, it's just looking at your pieces. I, I keep forgetting about this castle. And we, okay, I'm just going to shove that up there. Now, I do seem to... Oh, now, now we can go for my favourite manoeuvre, right? Which worked so well in the last time. We can try to get this one in. Because his knight is pinned by this cheeky little bishop. And I might even have bishop b1. And doing something there as well. So I could now come forwards. Got to watch out. I didn't actually see that was an idea. So that's quite lucky. And he's got knight. Oh, he hasn't got knight f4 because it's pinned. <laughs> but he's got rid of my pawn there. It's, it's, it's just chaotic. I don't know what's going on here, guys. I have no idea. And I'm, I'm running out of time. So I'm going to have to try and speed up. It looks like my bishop should be good, doing a good job. And now he's got his knight potentially coming in there. But am I safe playing this? Am I safe playing this? Okay, I don't know. Oh, God. What am I... Okay, he can't take that. I keep forgetting about his bishop. Because what well, he can take there. But I think this... Works out well. It's Ginger GM. Well. Gain okay, something cool. from that. Right. Well, let's play on. So this is the game but I had. The time situation is, is not my friend. Taron, but my bishop's now is defending everything. Straight. Well, but he's very, very don't young. actually like that move. As and soon as sometimes you play a move and you're like, no, I don't like that move because now my pawn concentrating on today, but is a target. To I've got bishop c3, which just about saves it. We're getting one second per move. This position should be good for me. You're encouraged to I don't normally drink when I'm playing chess. I'd like to say that. It should be event, good for me. But and it's clarifying one, a little bit now. Um, so, clarifying okay, a lot okay, now, now. And I think I've got enough time. Uh, because the one second of move, as long as I sure the just okay, shove this one up the board, we'll I'm going to be yeah, safe. Any problems. Uh, and that's exactly now, what I'm going to do now. Quite can bring, even bring the king into b7. E4 and play it like this. And there's not much he's going to be able to do. Because that pawn is... Uh, against I was going to take my advancing take over here and I can even here. do a cheeky little swinger now D6. look at that for a cheeky this little is, swinger uh, and in we come uh, with a cheeky little check quite Whoa. strange looking position <sighs> the idea Whoa. that looks oh, like there's a an echo to me but I is there an echo it, it looks, it looks why is there an echo I don't know is there an echo again there should be an echo what white's gonna play is there an echo we're already talking I thought I was going crazy I am well I'm going crazy here that is we hear a video in the background oh hang on a minute proper axis is basically Sorry about that. How long was that going on for? Hopefully it wasn't going on too long. I've just been doing a bit of video editing in the background just to make just to make it even more complicated, right? Just to make it even harder. We're getting some video editing going on in the background, but that's that that's that's gone now anyway. So I've won every game so far, but look at Mary Hatman who apparently said he can't do this timeline. I'm playing Monique again now. Monique a good player. I'd like to get a game against Mary, but Ushko the Bears back up there. There's now 43 players long enough to question sanity. Well, any time's long enough to question sanity, right? I've certainly questioned my sanity on multiple occasions in my life. But I won't I won't go there. <laughs> um, one of the best sayings I heard about chess players was uh, chess... Ooh, hello. That's a nice check. Chess doesn't 
make you go mad. Chess, shall I even, okay, we'll take that one. Chess stops, what was it? It was the one, okay, I've got to get this right. Chess doesn't make you go mad. Chess stops mad people from going mad. Is that something like that? I phrased that totally wrong. Someone may be able to phrase that better. Um, it's hard when you're looking at a unique position, but I think I'm doing all right here um, because we've got these two ones, we, these two ones coming in. And I'm going to pick up another pawn now. I'm the exchange up. I'm time up, and I think with e6 here, it's looking a little bit dodgy for my opponent. Now he is threatening that, so I've got to be somewhat careful here. Now, just because obviously my king is in the same line of that, and now now all of a sudden he's got pressure. Oh dear, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Because I've got to do a little bit of defending now, and I haven't got much time. So something has gone wrong in this position for me. His bishops have come to life, and I've got to oh, I've got to be very careful, very careful in this position. Um, now his knight is on pre as well though so I think this might save me as in can we do that castling okay now my knight's on pre it's still really tricky this position for both of us trying to work this out oh no but he okay well, oh I think that was a mouse slip with no time left Oh, I feel like I was very lucky there. I feel I was very lucky in saving this one because I was definitely, definitely losing in this one. But you need a bit of luck. And uh, that was certainly a bit of luck for me here. And okay, the rest should be quite easy. My bishop's looking a little bit powerful here. And with bishop coming to e4. Okay, so, oh, oh no. Oh, did I, I thought I lost on time. Oh. <laughs> Oh, unlucky, Monique. That was tough. You were doing well there. And um, that ma I think you just mouse slipped. Okay, so now we're playing the person in the lead. And we're playing um, against Merry, who is leading the tournament with seven wins. He's cruising Merry at the moment. So I'm going to do my sort of... I'm going to do this weird little attack here. Because it seems like my bishop has a lot of potential, right? Um, so... Okay, what do we do? I'm going to just move this one out so that bishop has potential. This was a good move of Martin's to block my bishop out. So I'm just trying to get my other piece out now. But Martin's doing the same. He's developing very nicely. And this is what Fisher Random teaches you. It basically teaches... Oh, he's castled. I keep forgetting about this. I haven't castled once, have I? Have I castled once? I castled queenside in the first game. And... If he can get some stuff going, then there could be a little bit of an issue towards that pawn. So how are we going to deal with this? I want to try to get my knight here, but he can. Okay, I have to go here now. And oh, hello. The little assassin. The little assassin came to life there. In a position where I think Martin was doing quite well, actually. I have a feeling that, again, I could have been a little bit worse there. But now the extra queen's quite handy, isn't it, always? So I've won it every game so far. So far, so good. And, well, I'm afraid, Martin, your pieces are dropping here. But he might still be leading because I, I need to get more wins. Wow, I've got someone very high rated here. Who is this? Uncover opportunities. This guy's 26. 26, 36 at, at Fisher Random. That is incredible rating. So I don't know who my opponent is here, but he's obviously very good. And this actually looks like quite a normal starting position. Okay, I say normal. We're going to go for it. Look at that for a bit of madness. And we're going to use Harry as much as we can. And we're going to make this completely insane. As you can see, it's already getting quite insane. I don't know if I should have done that straight away. But now, after this one... He's got a little bit of problems, no? He's sort of defending everything. I'm going to try to get my queen now into the attack. 
And if I get my rook over as well, it's a little bit of pressure, a little bit of pressure here. Okay, now the next thing to do is get is to get my queen in. And he can't block it because his rook's on pre. And this position, if I can get some more pieces into the attack, it's going to be practically winning for me. But I don't know how we can do that. We'll give him a little check for now, just to see where he goes. I need to get this bishop into the attack. Okay, we'll move it here. No point going for a draw. But he's very, very quick, isn't he? He's very quick, this guy. I'm going to keep the queens on, but I've got to remember, I am a pawn down. This is a nice idea, trying to get that one around. So we're going to move that one in. And let's get my last piece out. But maybe he's sorting his position out. Very hard to say with his time limit. Oh, no, can't come there. I'm going to grab that pawn so we're not a pawn down anymore. Maybe I could have... It's quite a hard one to defend, actually. Oh, time. He's going to do me on the clock, isn't he? Unless I hurry up. Okay, I've got to hurry up here. It's a very nice position, but he's got his little tactics in there. I missed that one. Oh, we're... oh dear. This guy's good. But I, I had certainly a winning position. Oh, this is annoying. I've kind of thrown this away. And certainly thrown this position right away here. He was too quick, this guy. Far too quick for me. I can't do this speed. So well done to my opponent. Be interested to know who he is, but this is my first loss on my streak as well. And yeah, I'm clearly struggling now. But I did have such a great position. We're going to resign that one. There's nothing I can do. So well done to my opponent for taking me down. That might mean my chase for first now. I need to win every game. He was super fast. I did have, I'm sure, a winning position there, but it, it, it was very hard to convert. There's still 37 minutes left, so anyone can still win the tournament. That was annoying that I threw that one away, certainly. Certainly felt like I, I was doing well, but we can see this, the leaderboard. The person I just played, where is he? He, he can, well, he's he only played a couple of games, which he's won. So he's trying to make a bit of a rush now. And Merry's still at the top with some very good players. I need to go faster. I'm going as fast as I can. How can I move faster? I need to move faster. Yeah, it's easy to say, isn't it? It's easy to say. <laughs> I'm going I'm going literally as fast as I can while commentating. If I go any faster than this, I'll be going I'll I'll, I'll I will be not being able to move my pieces. This is not my ideal time limit. Um so this is actually again one of the more normal starting positions right because we've uh look at our king side our king side looks very sensible uh with both of us being able to castle but i'm going to keep up my sort of strategy of not castling uh if i if i can help it and i should have an advantage here because of this file and now if i can just get this knight to a better square well, I found that again. That's the one thing Fisher Random kind of teaches you. Can I castle? I like that. Okay. It's to work out which are your bad pieces and get them to the squares they want to go to. Now, that's quite crafty because he had knight takes here if I went onwards. But now my knight seems to be creeping out. And with the bishop coming here at the right stage, it could be, it could be quite good for me but I've got to be careful of this diagonal if he can get his queen on that diagonal and that's a good move because now he is threatening to get his queen on that diagonal so and he's threatening my bishop whoa all of a sudden I miss this idea and I'm very slow as people keep pointing out ah oh, dear okay this is not good I need to I've misplayed it um, he's doing some tricky moves now if I lose another one the tournament is over so Trying my best. Got rook a2. Why didn't I go rook a2 last move? That would have been that would have been crushing it. Okay, I'm gonna give that one back because it's too down. Oh, he's got check, mate. Oh shit. Oh, he missed it. He had check there. That would have been killing me, right? We he missed that move. Oh dear. What am I doing? <sighs> 
Oh no, this is going so wrong. I'm misplaying this all over the shop. Now I've got it. Oh, he's got this one. He's winning. He missed it again. But he can do it now and he's winning. He's crushing it. I could have gone. Oh, oh, he's still missing it. I'm so lucky so far, but I've, I don't know if I'm going to be able to survive this one. Let's just do this and pray. I'm praying. Can my king escape? Hopefully it can escape. Oh, I think my opponent literally missed a couple of mating ones here. And now he's the one getting mated. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. oh, it's not too late to join. There's still over half the tournament left. It's only a one hour tournament. If you want to get into the get into the mix, then there is the link to join. So do come and join in. Um, you can play. People saying play faster. I can't play faster. You come and play faster. It's not easy. <laughs> Look at the position. You have to think about the position. I, If I could play faster, I would, but I'm not as sharp as some people like that. It takes me a while to get to grips. I'm an old man now. Give this old man a break, please. I can't play faster. This is fast enough, especially when commentating. I mean, look, you get positions like this all the time, and it's just absolute nonsensely madness in the position. I'm going as quick as I can, people. I'm going. I, I am old. I am old. I'm old. I'm no penguin. I'm no penguin, that's for sure. Um, I mean, Penguin's abilities at Blitz are absolutely phenomenal, right? That guy, I mean, why he's not 2700 strength at normal chess, I don't know. And this is, again, what... Okay, he's castled that way. Now, I'm not going to castle again. I seem to have some kind of a target to attack, but he has got this move, which I've just realised is a little bit annoying, D4. And he's played it, unfortunately for me. But on the other hand, can I now, don't know about that move because he just comes straight through the middle. That was a little bit silly. But I'm, is it, how is this? How is this? This is, a, an, again, a very peculiar position. I want to, well, I'm going to have to go for the ending here, I think. I didn't really want to. Queen Dare was another idea, trying to get active. Okay, well, he hasn't gone for the ending, but... This is also risky for him because his king is not 100%. Oh, 100%. Okay, now. This is quite scary, but I'm going to give my my king the c8 square to move to in this position. Because otherwise, if he gets any check, like bishop takes there, it would be mate. And we don't want to allow that. So this is why I'm playing as such, but have to get rid of that pawn otherwise it's too scary and now my king has this square which as long as i'm careful just got to avoid all these little nasty threats i feel should be okay for me now i'm gonna take that one and bishop e5 is the move i've always been trying to play and now i can play it and now that i can play that move oh oh okay so he's going for some perpetual now this shouldn't work because he hasn't even got any more checks here i think he actually had a much okay now now it should be quite easy of course so how are we in the tournament we're in third place blair has now got up to second place um you can come and join in in this really crazy roller coaster of a tournament which is one it's fish around him and it's one minute plus one second a move and we're really fighting at the top here with 30 minutes left and um, I'm now playing chess pats of Spain hello we've played many times before dangerous player and I'm not really sure about my first starter move there I'm not sure quite why I played that one um, I need to get my pieces out so if I mean I know you say play faster but it, it's so important at the start like this might win the exchange no, because he's got this pawn coming on. Okay, it doesn't win the exchange. And I spent 30 seconds, so I certainly have to move faster in this game. But it's also important not to get a completely lost position. 
from the first couple of moves, which is very easy to do because there's no openings in Fisher Random. So you've got to think about your options. My opponent really quick here. Um, and he's playing good moves as well. My knight was uncomfortable there. And I think I can castle, can't I? I might have to castle in this game. Oh, look at that. Look at that for a move. And maybe even knight c2. My knight's not very good. Let's get that knight back. My opponent, on the other hand, is trying to bring his bishop to this diagonal. Is My, my rook could be looking stupid on this square. Well, it, it probably is looking stupid. And now there's pressure against this one as well. But okay, we need to try and take here. And I've got king to b1. So he's coming in with another dangerous move. He's playing very, very well. He's kind of got me right on the back foot in this game so far. My piece is all over on the wrong side of the board. You can see they're all over here, which is not where I want them. Oh, he's got knight here check. And if I take it, rook a1, checkmate. But look at my king. My king is really, 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 really uncomfortable. So I'm, tr I'm trying to desperately to defend. I think he must have had a winning attack somewhere. And now his bishop comes in. All his pieces are attacking me. Really scary. Don't like it. I need to try... I've got the. I've now got the time advantage, but he comes in with another one, and this one, if I take it, is mate. Takes check. It's mate. Beautiful move. He's got mate. I think he's got mate here. Beautiful chess from my opponent. Playing brilliant chess. Brilliant chess. I'm just trying to hold on. I'm trying to hold on. In a position where. Oh my god! Move move I just, that was crap i just wanted to play a move <laughs> don't know how i've defended this one so far this would be an absolute fluke if i win he played he totally deserves to beat me with his brilliant play i have to say he played phenomenal but he didn't have the finish whoa what a game that was i have to say my opponent played absolutely phenomenal in that game. Absolutely phenomenal. I should have lost that one. I should have lost that one. Did you see the win there? He played that amazing bishop check move. That was, a, that was an absolutely brilliant move that my opponent played. And if I'd have taken it, he would have uh, he would have mated me in some style. And he just he just collapsed a little bit at the end. I'm sure he had a couple of checkmates there. I was very very lucky to survive that one. But that, I have to say, so far out of all the games played, that was the best game that one of my opponents has done. Remember, you can join the tournament, guys. There's still half an hour left. It's only a one-hour tournament. There's the link to the tournament. And um, it's this crazy one-plus-one one Fisher random uh, where I've been quite lucky in some games, haven't I? I've been riding my luck a little bit. But at this time limit, you know... You're going to have to expect that because it is stupid time length. Now, how do we come in here? Is this a useful square for the queen? Feels like my piece, look at his piece, is a little bit worse. I'm just wondering if this is castling, castling queenside move. Is, is this still legal? Probably not. I don't know. Maybe I'll try it. Have I moved my rook? I, I don't always oh, move this king there. So I'm going to put my bishop in there. And I'm going to try and... Is this work? Oh, yeah. It's, it's so satisfying to castle in these crazy fish around in positions. Now, it does look like this is a very dangerous diagonal. And I might have some sacrificial ideas coming up. Uh, maybe with... You know, I can just take this one. It's not even a sacrifice. But I'm even thinking of some crazy ideas of bishop b8. Let's try this. This looks like fun because he's very short of time. We're going for a little tricky idea here, which is boom. And this little tricky idea is threatening the queen to come in. Boom. <laughs> that was just naughty. So have we got a chance of winning the tournament? Well, Mary, Mary said he wasn't very good at this. And Mary, Martin is leading. Ushko, Blair is second. This is like really tough. And now I'm playing Carrie from Iceland, one of my favorite places in the world. And 
um i think carrie was in the chat yesterday so i wish i could move quicker but i can't i just want to the reason i spend a bit of time at the start is i'm looking at all my pieces and i'm trying not always succeeding but i'm trying to at least um find a good sort of strategy to to put them you know i want i i think she could have taken that pawn and it's not easy to work out where all your gonna all your pieces are gonna go in a split second, right? It's really not easy. And my opponent here is developing her pieces very well. I think it's a her. I'm I'm, just, I'm sorry if it's not. Um, sounds like a female name. Um, but I've got a little bit of a pawn center going on, so we want to eventually use these pawns somehow to move forwards might give me a slight advantage my 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 advanced pawns but this is a good move trying to like probe me over there so i'm just going to defend this pawn because then that means this pawn can come forwards but the main move i want to play is this but i can't play this now because that pawn if you see what i mean so why am i not doing this one thing i'm not doing in these games is utilizing harry the h pawn i can't believe mary is storming he's on 42 points is anyone there we go now harry's coming is anyone going to stop mary Mary's having a brilliant tournament. He's actually leading with 23 minutes to go. Bullet 960. It's the most insane chess you will ever see, isn't it? Can you get more insane than this? I don't think so. Especially for old men like me who, who, are, who are far too slow. Far too slow for this time limit. Thank you for uh, the donation there. James Blunder. Uh, thank you. Um... I don't know if that is uh is that Jabava? Maybe it is Jabava, I'm not sure. What's going on here? My opponent my opponent's playing very well. Hello so man. Nice to see you. Hope we board. will have some drinks um, soon. Thank you for the donation. Bada. Was, was that Jabava? Thank you very much, man. Very generous of you. Very nice to get a donation from the main man. Oh, my opponent resigned. Well that was strange. I thought she was doing quite well there. Why did she resign? That was strange. She was doing really well. I mean, okay. Oh, her time run out. That she didn't resign. Her time run out. Oh, pff, it's too insane. This this time limit. Um, so I, I don't know if that was. Did I just get a donation from Jabar um, Jabava? That would have been quite legendary if I did. Thank you so much if I did. Okay, now if I get a knight there, it's checkmate. Let's go for scholars, mate. Right? Let's see, scholars, mate. <laughs> I'm actually. This is so cheeky. I'm at. Boom. Boom. Oh my god. That was ridiculous. That was absolutely a ridiculous trap. That was like the the this is why you've got to take a bit of time at the start, yeah. That was oh my words, I enjoyed that trap. It wasn't quite checkmate though. But that was that was a really that was really ins Oh, 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 hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. I see your game. I was gonna take the rook there, and then knight takes there would have been checkmate. Oh, I nearly fell. I nearly fell into checkmate myself. I mean, what the hell? What the hell's going on? So, <laughs> Stu absolute stupidity this is. Um, uh, what the hell? Hello. hello. Uh, hello. Hey, hey, James. Uh, thank you so much for the donation. We're doing a bullet. We're doing a bullet 960 tournament. Um, there is only, uh, there's not long left now. Uh, oh, I checkmate you with a pawn. Oh, um, there's only like 20 minutes left of the tournament. Um, but next, we, I'm going to try to do this more Saturdays. So I'll let you know. I'll let you know the next time we do one, right? So, uh, and I'm in third place at the moment. Um, and yeah, by the way, I, I, James Blunder, you are the famous Jabava, aren't you? Is that right? And who's got his, he's got his own stream now. And is a brilliant streamer and a bloody brilliant player one of the best players around uh and and you're a bit like me uh you don't know how to castle i'm not i'm not even sure i've never really castle there you go that's how you castle apparently that's how you do it apparently so that's how you castle uh <laughs> you'd be excellent at this game you'd be amazing at this game um you are certainly be better than me i i'm i'm getting and blair's in second place so i've got to try and try and up my game a little bit here oh i don't like that one let's let's i don't like oh i could have castled again this is bad and even yeah this is this is actually really bad as in like tragic oh dear pay attention simon 
And look at Blair's time. Why is he so quick? What's going on? He's too quick. Okay, so I'm, I'm actually in a worse position here. Definitely. We've got to try to do a little bit of concentration here. But um, now I could go... I don't know. Let's just play this. I'm too slow. Let's do this. This looks like... It was a pawn sack. That's what it was. It was a pawn sack. I need some. I need some beer. Yeah. I mean, it, it might well, it might well be happening soon. Now, can we do this? Am I going to get in some trouble? Can Rook D8 be played? What is this? I'm so bad at calculating. I'm so bad at calculating nowadays. Literally, so so slow at calculating. Um. Well, my idea is just to do. So I could have done that straight away. Why don't I do that straight away? What kind of, what kind of, what kind of idiot am I? Now, if I go here, well, let's just see what happens. Let's just see what happens. If Rook D8 is something going to happen, I don't know. I don't. I think it might be a. Is it a bluff? No, it's not a bluff. It might. Maybe Rook D8 is playable. Oh God! Now I have to think quickly. This should be good. Why? Oh come on, Simon. Just move, man. Ah. That is the kind of rubbish that you sort of play when you just, when you know, oh no, okay, the queen's coming off. And now I better move that one. Should have been winning there. Should have been winning there somehow. What, some One of us should have been winning. And now I'm now I'm losing. Now, now, Blair, oh, I missed that one. That was, oh no, this is, this is terrible. It's too quick for me. This is just far too quick. Absolute nonsense. And of course, because there is one second to move, my chances of, you know, doing anything here is is very, very low. Um, so I'm sort of been given some, like, glimmer here, maybe. Um, but not much of a glimmer. Oh, oh, mouse slip. Mouse slip. Do we take it? Oh, my words. That was rude. Blair, mouse slipped against me. Oh, why am I doing this? I'm still playing badly, even after the mouse slip. Do we offer a draw because he mouse slipped? Oh, okay. I'll offer, I'll offer him a draw. Oh, no, it's too quick. If I get time to offer him a draw, I'll offer him a draw. There you go, Blair. Because that was a clear mouse slip. I feel bad winning this one. Oh, you won. Oh, dear. Oh. <laughs> well, no comment. I'm not even going to say anything there. I'm just not saying anything, man. Um, I should have been winning there. I'm sure... Jabava in the chat would have found the win for me. It's lovely to have you in 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 the chat here, uh, Jabava. It was James Blunder, by the way. So uh, thank you, thank you for you coming coming and joining in the stream. I I have to I'll come and pop over to your stream and try to give you a bit of support sometime as well. Um, it's probably quite embarrassing watching me play, though. I mean, this is this is uh, this is yeah. I mean, how long have we got? We got fifteen minutes, and I I'm in second place and. Well, that last one, I felt guilty there, hence the draw offer, because I was completely losing. And Blair, who was in third place, played pretty damn well there. Um, I don't think I really deserved to win that one. It's a fun tournament, but now that Blair, now that he did sort of, well, now that I did win that one, I'm gonna, I'm desperately trying to chase up with Mary in first place. We got 16 minutes left, so there may still be a bit of time if I can get some quick wins on the board um and well i say quick wins on the board we will take that one we will take that one uh don't lose my queen on h8 um i'm for i'm i mean <laughs> oh, the amount of queens i am losing in, in in this in this absolute madness is is insane what about if i get my knight there let's go for a little cheeky rubbish let's go for that shall we oh can we do it is he gonna fall for it what am I think? What am I talking about? That's not. I thought it's king and queen the other way around. I'm not, I've gone completely bonkers, completely mad. What was that? I, I literally. But even then, if it's king and queen were the other way around, it wouldn't be checkmate. What is going on? What is going on here, people? Have I just literally lost the plot? I think I've literally lost the plot here. Oh, I, I need. I need. I need to have a beer after this one. You're right. This is. This is clear. <laughs> this is clear okay right anyway onwards onwards bound I, i've lost the plot to everything that's going on and um i suppose for me 
Yeah, no worries. No worries about the sub. I think you. I think you deserve it. I think. I mean, like the way I'm playing at the moment is quite embarrassing. But we're actually taking the first spot now somehow. I don't know how we can be in first place with all these horribly losing positions that we're getting. Um, and playing moves like this, allowing knight takes there, it's not getting any better, is it? It's not getting any better. Give me the damn beer. And who am I playing here? Well, I'm playing 1800 from India. He's playing pretty, playing pretty well against me. But we're now down to our last 25 seconds, and this is where this is where it goes. But we're in the lead. We're actually in the lead. But what am I doing in this position? I don't really like my position at all. I don't really know what I'm doing. And he's going for some dirty tricks here. Oh, can he do that one? Look at this. I'm blundering everywhere. This is an embarrassment in blunders. Okay, let's go for some action. Come on, have my rook. You can have my rook. Have it. He doesn't want my rook. He doesn't even want my rook. Is this how you castle? How'd you castle? How'd you castle? Oh, I didn't even know how to castle. Okay, my position's got a lot better because now at least I'm not losing the whole rook. I'm just losing everything else. And I've got to start moving with a little bit of speed. He, I think he should have taken my rook. It was all bluff. It was absolute. I wasn't really doing anything at all. I, I, wasn't, even, I wasn't even threatening anything. I just, I just had a check or two with my knights. But now his position is getting a little bit scary, right? Because G3 is looking a little bit, a little bit, a little bit dangerous. And we're in. We are in. And, well, let's keep that one on the board. Probably not a very good square. I just put it on. And I'm still... What, am I, what was that last move I played? Disgusting moves I'm playing. Oh, no, I lost the time. I wasn't even looking at my clock. Oh, man. That was embarrassing. Queen A8. Oh, no. I totally forgot to look at the clock. That was ridiculous. Ah, oh, this was the right move, clearly, because I, I cover my back rank and I'm coming in there. Could I have taken his queen? I probably could have taken his queen. The reason I did not take his queen is because I didn't see it, basically. That is the reason. In we go with the little cheapo trick. He spotted it. <laughs> you never know. That I want to get. I want to get another victim with this one. But um, oh, that last game. But I'm still somehow in first place, which I find quite hard to believe. I certainly need to win this one because we've got two people biting on my heels here, and um. Can we do this? This is a little bit risky. Queen, just moving the queen back, just forgetting about the time was pretty, pretty bad. I wouldn't go as far to say embarrassing. I think you're being very harsh, pro player. Very harsh. Why aren't you playing? If you're that bloody good, get your ass on the table. That's what I say. Um, well, this is looking still all right, but it's going to be a very close finish in the tournament. With only 11 minutes left, and it's really random. I can't afford to lose another game. That was embarrassing. Like, it lost my streak. And what I mean by that... Okay, what what was that all about? I'm going to go here. What I mean by that is you get your streak and you get more points as you go along. So it uh, certainly, uh, certainly uh, is good. And now my position looks great, right? It looks great here. But he's just defending. And he's got this check, so let's stop... Let's stop that one, and maybe we can bring our bishop in. But last piece is getting the rook somewhere useful. And I'm just trying to—I was trying to work out if this move was working, which I think it was. So I'm going to play it now. It's a very complicated move for him to deal with. But I could have maybe—I don't know if knight check there first was better. But his king is in quite a dangerous situation and what is the best way to go about doing this oh man time again i don't see a finish here ah that is just a bad move i'm so bad when i get short of time he's defended and he's defended well and now 
I have a lot of pawns, so it's actually kind of all right for me because my pawns are very good. And I might now just shove this guy up the board. Keep it simple, right? And maybe this one as well. Let's just shove them all up the board. And oh, I'm a bit greedy playing that move. I don't really need to do that, especially when I could win his knight. Uh, okay, that didn't work. We'll go back. I'm just going to try to take all of his pawns because it just looks like fun taking all of his pawns and I'll get my king out of the way oh, he's... okay he's trying to come in with a check so let's allow that check oh shit what happened there okay took that one. Oh, okay time don't lose on time Simon don't lose on time so far so good don't lose on time Mr Williams and okay we're there so does that mean we're still in first we're still in first there's nine minutes left i'll just try to show you the timer as well we can just put this on somewhere so you know how much time is left in the tournament we'll put it over my advertisement for now you can see the timer is ticking down and we have ezra in second place and Blair just behind him. Mary has dropped down a little bit in the ranking. Is he going to try this one on me? Actually, how do I stop that? What the hell? If he go, I can't believe it. If he goes knight there, could I have stopped him taking that one? That was insane. I don't think I could have defended that one. He should have gone for the cheapo mate there. That would have that would have put me under a bit of pressure. But this, okay, so at the moment I'm only three points up, which is not much, right? Not much. So we've got to, how many more games are we going to get in? A couple more games. We need to, uh, um, okay, he's castling. He's putting his king over there, so I'm just going to throw my pawns at his king. Looks like an all right thing to do, right? Throw, the, throw those ones at him. And maybe we're, okay, let's just play this first. I don't want that queen sneaking its way in to my position. But... I do want my knight coming in there. I didn't even see he could do that, but uh, I can't castle now. And don't fall for that cheapo that he's just set up. This actually, maybe I could have played that this move last move. Because if he'd have taken it, I had a king here. That would have been very interesting, actually. But okay, this has still got to be good for me. Look at his embarrassing bishop on this square over there. And now, well... This is nearly mate. Um, do I have something flash here? I don't see it, so I'm just going to play this one. There may well have been a flash way to do it, but this is the simplest just taking. Now, don't get checkmated. No, 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 no. Don't you go trying that on me. And I now still got to be a little bit careful after this knight comes in but if I get the queens off it's gonna take all those dangerous ideas away from him and this is winning now should be winning stop his knight coming to this square and I've got all the pawns everything here and let's use those guys to come forwards um not sure about some of my moves I'm playing here. He's very quick, isn't he? Why does why why is everyone so much quicker than me? And I'm gonna try to mate him, but it was not a very probably not the right thing to do. He's holding on. I can't believe he's holding on so much here. He's just holding on for grim life, isn't he? he keeps holding on. Go away with your Defensive holder honours. Right. Past pawns should be pushed. I'm sure someone said that. So let's push them. Okay. I'm just going to take that one because you're annoying me now. And I'm going to push. That knight was that knight was really annoying. Okay. Oof. Are we still in the lead? Okay. We're in the lead by one point. This could be a really exciting finish. There's five minutes to go. It's one point in the lead. And 
We now need to get a win, I think, very quickly. Blair is only one point behind me after after that mouse slip he had. I kind of feel like Blair deserves deserves to, to win this one this week, but I'm not obviously going to allow him to win it without a fight. That just wouldn't be right. So here we go. Look at this for an idea. If pa Okay, I've got a brilliant idea. If Pawn there, I wanted to go Queen H7. <laughs> Did anyone see that idea? Rook takes Queen. Knight takes their checkmate. But okay, I was just getting carried away. I get carried away with these crazy ideas. Um, that would have been quite funny, but um, probably not the best move. So how much time do we have? We're like, okay, I've been overtaken by Ezra as well. We've lost first place. Got to win quick here. We've lost first and we could be, oh no, we've got to win this one. We've got to win it quick and try to get one more game in. This is a real fight. Look at the scores at the top here. Look at the scores at the top. Okay, in we come. Speedy. This is about as speedy as I get, guys. And that looks like a good move that was played. And, oh, I'm just not speedy. Oh, man. Okay. <laughs> at, least, at least my opponent... Oh, that doesn't work, I'm afraid. At least for me, luckily for me, my opponent is also... Not the speediest. Forgot about the queen. I know it's very easy, but it's still a good move you played there. Um, I'm getting so confused now. Um, that was a good move, f5, right? I was going to say, at least my opponent's a little bit slow as well, but we need to get one more game in after this. Hang on a minute. How can you do that? That's not fair. You're not supposed to castle. And now I'm getting completely crushed. What the hell? What the hell happened there? What the hell happened? How did, how did that happen? How am I getting so crushed? Oh, I'm glad the rook didn't get taken. But I'm not that happy. Because I have to do this. This is not a, a move that a happy person plays, is it? You don't play. Thank you, thank you, Chibava. I might need... I might, I might need a bit of help here. Oh my words. Okay, off we go. I'm gonna need a. I'm gonna need a bloody miracle here. Oh no! What am I doing? Oh, oh, oh no! You muppet! Well done to my opponent. Ah! Oh, I just fell apart, man. I just fell apart. That was embarrassing. Ah oh, no! And now I'm in third place. Ah! Oh. oh! Oh! I give up. I give up. I'm not made. I'm not made for bullet. It's not for me. Give it to another man. Just don't get me involved with Bullet. That was just painful. That was painful. But my opponent played extremely well there at the end. So I, I must say well done to my opponent. Who started off quite bad. And then all of a sudden this castling move and a couple other moves. Just fell apart. Just fell apart there. So it's kind of a battle between the top two at the moment. After after what, what has occurred. Uh um so well i might still get third but even that is in a little bit of danger and we're, we've got what probably this is the last game that i'm going to be able to get in so we're just going to go for a, a sort of uh, uh we're going to go for this this idea trying to try to do something over there but oh i'm still i'm still i'm still heaving from that this rook's quite a good defender as well in actual fact oh not anymore because i can i must be able to do something over on the, this area of the board now um okay well we'll play there that doesn't seem to help my opponent too much can we just go for this idea maybe this is the one okay we're gonna try it we've got what one minute left of the tournament i think i'll be i'll be happy with third place but look at the okay i'm just gonna just keep going look at the battle look at the battle for first as well that last game that was the important game okay my opponent's defending you're not supposed to defend my threats I mean, whoever heard of an opponent who defends threats? It's not very fair. Well, we're going to go all in with some rubbish like this. I should have done that last move, of course. Um, that would have been much better because now King C2 is just a good, good defensive move. Well, it's a defensive move. Can I? I should be still doing well here. Um, with this little one but my time is unfortunately just not enough i say doing well i might not even be doing that well here 
Uh, well, I'm not doing that well. My opponent has a great pawn structure. This is going to be the last game. I might not even be able to finish this game in time. I won't. Is, is there really nine, four seconds left? No, don't say that. Ah. Oh. Okay. Deep breaths, Mr. Williams. Deep breaths. Deep breaths. Well, congratulations to Ezra, who won the tournament in first place. That's Ezra Kirk. Um, so, well done. That was completely insane. <laughs> that was far too intense. Well done. Well done for beating beating me there, um, Carrie. Um, congratulations. That was a good game you played at the end there. Um, I need to... I might have a lunchtime Saturday beer now. Who knows? I need to detox my brain after that one. Well, un well done to Ushko the Bear. I mean, Ushko kind of deserved, Blair kind of deserved first place there because he mouse slipped that completely winning game against me. So, Sportsman Award, Sportsman Award goes for Blair without a shadow of a doubt, who would have won the tournament had he not been such a great sportsman. So, well done to Ushko the Bear. Merry Hatman, you did pretty well, yeah? Merry Hatman, you did you did really well, right? You came fourth, man. Okay, I'll see you later, James. Um, are you streaming now? I can send people over to you if you are. Otherwise, otherwise we'll maybe try to sort something out for the future, yeah? Um, I say James, it's not James, what I'm talking about. I'm just, my brain's just gone. Obviously, not now, okay. Well, look, uh, we'll maybe try to arrange something, Shababa, in the future. And uh, again, it's an honor to have you in the chat. James Blunder in the chat will be streaming. It's Jabava, who's, well, one of the most creative chess players around, uh, or has been for a long time. So go and make sure you follow his channel, um, which is James Blunder, a bit after James Blonde. So you can go and follow his channel now. He's James Blunder in the chat. So at least you know when he's streaming and it's well worth it watching him streaming. I might try to catch that later on. I think legend is the right word. He is a legend. He is a legend among men. So go and check him out. And um, so Merry Hatman, I'm going to award a free digital download to you. So do do pick one from the shop. Drop me an email for doing so well. But thank you everyone who's taken part in the competition. It was a lot of fun. Um, I it's far too quick for me. I can't play. I can't play that quickly. My brain just does not go that quickly. It it really doesn't. So. Um, Thank you. We're going to give someone a raid now. And I'm going to put some more videos up on my YouTube channel. But they're from the latest streams I've done. Just in case you're interested. I have at the moment my course on sale. So you can get this course above. If you follow the links in the chat. It's on sale only for a little bit longer on the English opening. It's over 20 hours of video. So well worth well worth getting uh, if you want to learn everything about the English opening. And we're going to go and raid Chess Patsa now. Um, so thank you very much, everyone. Um, it's been an honor to have you all here. Thank you, Jabava, for coming and joining us in the stream. That was a real a real pleasure to have you here, Jabava. Go and check out Jabava's site. And uh, hopefully we'll be able to share a beer at some point in the future as well over in a proper tournament. But uh, everyone else, have a great day. I'll see you all later on. And thanks for playing this fun little random tournament. Goodbye for now. Cheers.